Welcome to Solo 21. We have now changed our icon theme to surfing. So what you're looking at is a plank with surfing icons and tools here, all elements from surfing. Now we're going to change the theme. As of yet, I've only installed applications and icons, but no themes. The themes are in the Raven panel here. You can change the themes. The icon theme is one thing, but there is also the theme of your system. We have already installed Vertex. There you go, that's Vertex. You see, it's not so optimal for this system. And we have also, let's change to Vertex Dark, maybe that's better. Uh, that's much better already. Okay. And then we have what the others. Well, maybe paper is good. Let's have a check it out. This is paper. If you like the white look, then it's okay. It's not too bad. There's, however, this white line. I'm wondering if it's the wallpaper. So I'm going to change the wallpaper. No, it actually is the paper theme that makes this white line. So, finding a great theme for your system is always an issue. Luckily, we have Arc and Arc Dark, which can save the day. You mix. Well, never intended to run on Solus. And this is how it will look then. So let's make something more interesting. Let's use something more beautiful and let's go and install ourselves arc dark, not blue with a blue accent, but an arc dark red. We can install that as well. And we have our little scripts on GitHub, Eric Dubois, Ultimate Solus. You have this little program which I called install GTK arc theme red version. So version one. While we may be, while we wait, we'll probably have the time to check the code. So let's install it in the meantime. GTK for Arc Theme Red. He wants my password. As you can see, a lot of software is going to be installed. 53 elements. Why? Because the best thing to do always is to run the program, run installation files on the system itself. So autoconf, automake, all of these programs are elements that we should install in order for the system, well, the system, uh, the Arc theme to run its auto-generating um, script and then making it in the end. So we're actually looking at it right now. So this is when it's made. And here you have now an Arc theme red as a new name. And this, this is the best way actually to be sure uh, that your theme is a beautiful theme on your system. So that being said, we're already ready. Let's kill this wallpaper. And then let's go to our elements. Let's see if it's already up to date. And see if it's in there. As you can see, new themes, new icons, it's not that fast. Uh, the Raven panel to reload it. That's why I have chosen to do something else. Uh, sometimes it will close. That's solved now, but I have to close this then. Um, the tweak tool. So the tweak tool, the GNOME tweak tool, is something that reloads quickly, and we can now select. Watch the red uh, text here, red dark, and the blue accents are gone in one, two, three. Now. So now we have an, the same theme, actually, actually the same, same theme, but with a blue accent, uh, sorry, a red accent as well here. It may happen that it's not in order that you have a blue on the bottom. That's because you have this setting here, uh, which is built-in theme. If you put this on the built-in theme, you will get the arc dark blue. 
as well as here the arc the arc blue so everything is gone again but if you really want to have the elements in the new version you just do this and then you have all these red accents which I personally always come back to so everything is now this reddish arc theme which I so like that's one example of theming